Hi, this one is a mixer motor. Many of you might have already seen the video in which I transformed this motor into a powerful generator. For those of you who haven't seen it yet, please click on the link above. So anyways, in this video, I am going to teach you how to run this 230 volts mixer motor with a 12 volts battery at an even higher torque. We all know that mixer motors operate at 230 volts, 50 hertz AC power supply and the same goes to the drill machines, angle grinders, jigsaws, etc. So to run this at 12 volts DC, I am going to make a very simple modification. First thing that you should notice about this motor is that it has 6 wires, 4 from the field poles and 2 from the armature windings. So the first step will be connecting the field poles in parallel. Okay. So you see two wires from this field pole. I am going to take one of the wires and connect it to one of the wires of the other field pole. You see the small black wire. So I am going to connect this red wire to the small black wire. Okay, so it's done. Now we have to connect the remaining two wires of the field poles. Okay, this one is left and this one is left. So we are going to connect it together. Okay, so this is the first field pole and this is the second field pole. One wire is taken from the second field pole and is connected to the first field pole wire and the second wire is connected to this one so now both of the field poles are in parallel now what we are left with are the armature wires which are these two yellow and green so what we are going to do is we are going to connect them in parallel as well And now you should see here, you can see that it has started rotating. Yeah, so this is how you can run your mixer motor or your drill machine motors at just, at just 12 volts. And if you want to increase the RPM and the torque, you have to increase the input voltage supply. At present I am using 11 volts, so it is operating a bit slow and if I will increase the voltage to 32 volts or even higher like 48 volts, the speed will increase accordingly. Okay, So guys this is a 32 volts DC supply, I am going to measure it for you. Yes, yeah, it is pointing towards 200 volts. Okay, so you can see that it is 32.1. Reverse the polarity and it will come in positive. Yeah, 32.1 positive. So, yeah, connecting the first wire. Now the second wire. Okay. See the shaft. 
you can see that it is rotating really fast now so this method is really useful since DC motors are really difficult to get if you don't want to purchase it but mixer motors are easily available so guys thank you so much for watching it this was all about how we can convert a 230 volts universal motor into a 12 volts battery operated motor thank you so much for watching it thank you